This is the what not to do video. Take a look. See how many communication mistakes you can identify. So what did uh, the brand manager say? So the brand manager wanted us to get one more point in the copy. Hmm. Yeah, and we're kind of just up against the wall. We, want, we don't really know if we have that much time. So I'm just wondering, like, should we push back? Well, first off, why don't we see if we can take another pass at the copy and see if we can make it work. So I'm just like wondering if I just have enough time. Or, or who, who should we work with? Or? Why don't you work together, try to see if you can make it happen, but we should at least take a pass at it before we try to immediately push back. So it's like, okay, so we're, we're going to have to work together on this, mm -hmm. and so we're just going to like have to yep. make time. Yep. What else we got? So how many did you count? There were quite a few. Some of the obvious ones, don't fiddle with your hair, don't play with your jewelry, don't nod your head unless you're in agreement, don't bob your head around, it's distracting, don't ask questions that don't advance the conversation, don't be apologetic unless there's something to apologize for, and don't use filler words. Go back, take a look at this video again Knowing what not to do can help you decide what you should do going forward.